observations today is we put in the entrance reducers. The miter weight quick strips have been in for a week. Uh, you, you do see a lot of debris here that's from the bees cleaning out uh, brood that was infested or just old. You'll also see a bunch of white pollen coming in. Uh, I believe I believe the only thing active in the area is goldenrod, really, so unless somebody planted something something different, it's, uh, it's goldenrod. However, I still have to look up and see what the pollen color is for goldenrod. Uh, I know the flower is nice and yellow, and we have some in the back here. I'll, uh, I'll get a picture of it later. You also see, which uh, maybe you see them in the back towards the top of the screen, uh, there are yellow jackets flying around, and that's from the Mitaway quick strips. We throw them in, and uh, the bees start dying, or they're cleaning out house, and it's all left on the front porch here. And then the yellow jackets will come and get them. Uh, that's why I'm putting in the reducer. It's been seven days, and that's what it says on the package for the Mitaway quick strips. So after seven days, I can put the reducer back on. Uh, and then hopefully that will help the bees keep the yellow jackets out. Uh, I haven't seen any actually go in over the last seven days. I just, uh, I'm getting worried because there's more and more every day it seems like. And I hung some of those uh, wasp traps out. And they've been getting them. But not at the rate of growth. So there's been more and more every day and the trap's getting them. But... It's just not, not enough right now. Anyway, wanted to share that and give you a peek at the entrance of what was our nuke and is now an 8-frame hive. Okay.